Hey guys, it's Renee. So for this phone case, I'm going to be using this off-white acrylic paint that I did myself, like I mixed myself. I'm going to be using this brush. This is a, an eyeshadow brush, by the way. I never use like actual arts and crafts ones. I think that the eyeshadow ones or the makeup ones, the bristles are softer. And I'm going to be using the silicone phone case. This used to be clear at some point. But yeah, you can start off with a white phone case if you prefer. So I'm going to be covering my phone case with my off-white, covering everything like front, uh, sides. I'll give this to the tree coats and I'm letting it dry in like a bottle on top of it. I'm going to be using this olive green acrylic paint now. I do have the DIY showing you how I mix this. I'm using a thin brush, like a delicate like arts and crafts one. And I'm going to be painting the branches and the like leaves. There's no like order that I'm like following to paint this. And for this phone case, I'm going for like hand painted feel to it. So the least perfect it looks, the better. Like in some parts I ran out of paint and I just kept going painting a few of them and then just the same with like the leaves all over the place. Now I'm gonna be using a small round sponge. I got this in a kit with these other ones and I'm using like the smallest one of the kit. I'll be working with this pink as well. This is another like acrylic paint mix that I did. It's like a mop pink but from my like sponge I'm gonna be using like the back of this like a big dotting tool. I'm pretty much gonna be painting that and then just stamping this and first I'm gonna be stamping or painting the middle part and then six more circles around it. Just making a pink daisy painting the like spaces that i have there then at the end i'm gonna go with my sponge and just give it a bit of like a twist like a twist -roo, just so that it doesn't have like strokes from my brush i cleaned my tool by the way with some acetone and then i'll use that as a big dyeing tool to just grab some off white paint and then just stamping or painting a big circle in the middle but i'm gonna be adding some gloss this is the one that i'm using it's like a spray gloss that i got at home depot workout site wear my gloves and i'll add two coats of this one and i'm adding this gloss and just so that everything comes together it almost uh, looks like it's it's printed when you add the gloss and you know just to seal the design so it lasts longer when i added the gloss though i went a bit too close to the phone case the green part can like bleed a little bit but i really like this i called it inspired hawaiian phone case i've never actually been to hawaii but from what i have seen online they have like stunning nature yeah this reminds me of something like that but i really like how it turned out i think they look really cute and i love the color combination of like olive green and that pink but yeah hopefully you like this as much as I did. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Check out the more phone cases that I have on my channel. Subscribe for more and share this. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye!